up guys this is astronox i want to go over the ranking in arena this is going to be on global first and then i'm going to go and check the ranking in europe because the week is about to end in global there is still over seven hours left but in uh in europe there is only 37 left uh, 37 minutes left so that's why i have to do it now and uh like Soon we're going to have a bunch of Moonlight heroes getting nerfed and it will definitely change the meta, especially with the, the heroes that are getting buffed as well. So this is going to be really interesting to see after how, uh, like which heroes are, are getting more use and all that. So uh, yeah, of course, we see a lot of Crimson Armin, a lot of, uh, a lot of, a lot of her because it's just like increases the team survival by so much. It's uh, it's ridiculous. There's a lot of seaside Bellona, and uh, actually, let me just open up the whole list. Bell and season. There is uh, quite a few of those, but it's it's Crimson Armin. Like she's almost everywhere. Uh, probably in uh, like over seventy percent of the team compositions are using Crimson Armin because she's too good. That that's why she's getting nerfed. Arbor of Vildred is probably being used in 40 to 50% of the team, something like that. Bell and Season, ML Bell and Season, uh, maybe 30%. Still a uh, few dizzies. Seaside Bellona, she is uh, quite a few of her. Destina. This Tina is uh, showing up more now because because of the uh, skill enhancement, her uh, her minus one turn cooldown on skill three is actually a big deal. Five turn cooldown down to four turn cooldown, super cool. Arbor of Vildred, ML Araminta, she's not here that much. Assassin Cartuja, such an amazing four-star hero. I was lucky enough to pull him on this uh, account number one on Global. So I'm working on uh, building him. ML Ravi. She's showing up. Probably running a counter set. With uh, Strike Gauntlet. Super high effect resistance, something of the sort. Charles, martial artist Ken, is uh, seeing a lot more play now because I remember some weeks where I was going through the list and maybe in the top 100, like, I would spot one martial artist Ken. It's ridiculous. But uh, I feel like he's going to be uh, way more popular in the uh, in the meta after the nerfs Arbor of Vildred I mean he's definitely we're not gonna be seeing as many of course but I mean his whole kit is still quite par uh, powerful Violet Violet is gonna see more play too for sure Charles I got him on my third account on Europe and can't wait. He's almost level 60. Can't wait to uh, give him some gear and set him on my defense. And I have Isaria too, so I could do some uh, some pretty cool things there. Ruel of Light. She's so good. She's so, so good. And Mela Ramenta, I mean, th there's still quite a few... Dark Corvus is not. I don't like. I haven't seen so many of him. So I could go down through the list at about the same rate now. One more time. Maybe you. Uh, oops! I don't know what happened there. Maybe you want a quick pass. Corvus. Made Chloe, Angelica, Corvus, 
Corvus, Corvus. Really, really good. Mel Ravi. I actually want to see how many ML Ravi are in the top bike and I'll be back so I was going through the list and there's like four Destina and four ML Ravi. There is, uh, it was like 17, 17 Seaside Bellona. I just wanted to see uh, for myself and I'm telling you guys at the same time. So let me jump onto the Europe server. All right, the Europe server now. Let's check the ranking. Let me open up the whole list. So on uh, on Europe, there's okay 30. How many are in? Okay, it's actually yeah, like 31 players that are in Legend. It's more than before. Before I remember, when I was in Legend, it was 20, 22, 23 players in Legend. That's it. And I remember top 100 even had uh, players in uh, Challenger. So now it's, uh, yeah, definitely more players. That's why it's Champion Plus. But yeah, more competition. More competition to be at the top. Of course, I mean, the higher league, less spots. Of course, there's less players, but still, I feel like it's, uh, it's, quite, it's quite rough. I, I'm a free-to-play player, but still, uh, I did... Uh, Min max pretty hard, of course. The sky stones now. I just got a boost of sky stones from doing uh, Abyss. 75? 75 gave 1500. That was cool. Anyways, here's the ranking. So it, it is definitely different. I mean, there, there's no. There was no Guilty Gear collaboration. There's no DN. There's no Luna. So. Yeah, let, let's just go through the list here. But Arbiter Vildred, man, he is in uh, quite a bit of teams but it, it's not that hard to tank the like leave teams but like in Arbiter Vildred it's always sketchy especially with the uh, dual attack triggers yeah there's more variety here that's for sure Not as cancerous as on global. But things are about to change for the better, so that's really cool. Yeah, I dropped out of top 100. I've been in top 100 since uh, the Europe uh, server got released. But my offense has been in struggle. I have not spent as much time as I would like to to uh, like find uh, players to attack and yeah I've been actually feeding my attack like I've been attacking the same player and lose, lo losing 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 just to get conquest points because uh, I've been out of time and it's hard it's hard to find a team that doesn't have sustain Yeah, there's a lot of Seaside Bellona, and uh, I invested a lot into my can and he's fire, so that definitely doesn't help. I have Fallen Cecilia too. Seaside Bellona is, uh, counters her pretty hard, like, because uh, I'm, I'm running a turn 2 team, and uh, like I have to tank the damage, and I'm running immunity on most of my heroes. 
but still if you get if if I get stripped and the fast down gets applied and they cleave me with uh, like a a really good cleaver Arbiter Vildred like uh, Bloodblade Karen a lot of different setups that can be ran but it definitely hurts man the fans down is so so strong with the attack attack buff and cleaving it's it's quite ridiculous the amount of damage output they can do and I mean I'm not stacking effect resistance across all my heroes I'm relying mostly on uh, the immune set and uh, using Angelic Mumratzi that has high effect resistance over a hundred to uh, to just cleanse plus this Tina on immunity. I mean, it works. It does the job. And I'm farming Golem 11, so my heroes are super tanky. Now that I have Crow, I uh, I will gear him out and try him on my defense. This is my defense that I'm running right now. And to be honest, like it's pretty much all my defense. Like it's holding me into champion, and uh, like my attack rate has been terrible. Oh man, I closed the list. Let me reopen it. But yeah, Crawl's gonna be a lot of fun to incorporate in my team. I'm thinking like drop can make Fallen Cecilia a bruiser again with Elbris Ritual Sword. Put Aureus and like make Crawl uh, super tanky, run him with immune set immunity set. Like I'll try to run everyone with immunity set, but it might just be three out of my four heroes until I, I get some, I complete another set with okay stats. Yeah, so many different heroes, it's cool. But the top cleave teams, they really hurt. Like so many times I've been fighting uh, players at the top and like, they, like I tank the damage, but then something happens like uh, Arbiter Vildred comes back and uh, like I, I have to like pop him before I even get the souls to uh, S2 and to S3 with Ken to like combo kill him and uh, like he comes back and then I, I like try to kill him but then there's a bunch of dual attacks tr that triggers when he has the attack buff especially if there's a defense down that drops on my team oh my god ridiculous I'm on a damage that can happen but uh, yeah luckily he's getting nerfed But sustain, yeah. For for a while, there was no sustain on the on the top teams, legend or high high champion. But then, like they started to show up and it started to be tank, like more and more tanky. So it's definitely hard to deal with them now. Well, harder. All right, well, that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm Astronox. Like, comment, and subscribe for more. Press the bell icon if you like to be notified whenever I release a new video. And check out my other videos. They should be showing up on the screen now. Playlists of all sorts. Arena, Guild Wars, Guides, Tips, and Autos, and Abyss Floor 62+. So check those out if you haven't. And also join my Discord server. It's in the description. Good luck with all you do in the game. Peace out for now.